All right, so we're going to go ahead and pull all these spark plugs out. I've already loosened them all up. We're going to try looking down each cylinder and seeing if we can see the condition. I usually do like to have the uh, starter working so that I can move the pistons all the way down on each cylinder that I look at. This is the tool I use. It's a, like a, uh, it's a stethoscope. It's a, called ProVision 100. There's uh, this little mic here when you look down in it. There's two little holes are lights and the big hole is the scope that you're looking through. And there's an adjustment here so I'm going to attempt to stick this down into the hole and um, see what kind of condition the cylinders are in. So I'll see you here in a second if I can see anything. Let's see. I don't think I'm seeing any holes in this cylinder. I do see the wash, what they call it when the piston and the, uh, comes up and down the, uh, the fuel, how rich or lean it is. So I do see some carbon buildup on this cylinder and I can see the wash on it. So that piston looks pretty decent. I think that piston is going to be okay. We'll know more when I do a compression check. Let's see if I can see this one, see how far down it is. That one's doing decent. Oh, wait a second. What's that? Oh. Let's see what I can get in this one. Oh, goodness. This piston looks all chewed up. It doesn't have any wash to it. It looks pretty melted up. I don't know that it has a hole in it. Let's see. But it doesn't look the greatest, that's for sure. Yeah, that piston looks terrible. Looks like you're running lean on this cylinder over here. The piston looks pretty damn chewed up. When I look at it from here, the piston looks hammered. It looks beat up in the corners. <clears throat> mm, wow, there's like no fuel on it at all. That one looks like it has carbon build up.